She is adored by many. Young, talented, beautiful, one of the world's greatest female sprinters. At the age of 19, she holds Jamaica's under 2100 meter record and has already collected her first Olympic gold medal. In today's video, we talk about the remarkable Brianna Williams. Greatest races, hashtag Brianna Nanamal. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the channel, people. If this is your first time here, thank you for making it Peter Lloyd World. If you have not already, subscribe and hit that like button. Hardcore fan or casual onlooker of track and field, most of us know about young Brianna Williams. These are our greatest races. For me, at age 13, in the 2015 clubs, she breaks the 100 meter record for girls. Club national record 12.27. Set by Simone Mason back in 2012. Brianna Williams, sorry, what she hit the 50 meter point and just had a different gear. And in one step, with the distance she needed for that win, but that was Brianna Williams, 12.25. Great performance, wow. To say that Brianna Williams is a sprint prodigy is somewhat of a kind of understatement. It's, it's pretty much stating the obvious. But another one of my favorite Brianna races is this one. The NACAC Under-18 Championship held in Mexico in 2019, where she ran 11.11. Four, Antigua and Barbuda, meter. Williams five, Jamaica, Hall six, Jamaica, Bascom seven. Head of the field, and she's going to wait for the time. Williams, 11.11 seconds on the board. Now people, I cannot always show you the entire race because I do not want to infringe on anyone's copyright and I want to, you know, do this correctly. Another one of my personal favorites, it's June 11th, 2019. And she's lined up against the greatest two sprinters on the planet, Delaine Thompson Hera and Shelly and Fraser Price after running a remarkable semi-finals the day before. And she delivers an ass astounding time of 10.94 now i must tell you that this time was never ratified but she ran 10.94 10.94 she was 17 years of age and she was lined up against elaine thompson hera then elaine thompson and shelly and fraser price at the national stadium june 11th 2019 and I want you to, to watch the interview with her coach, um, Coach Atta Bolden. I, um, I, I kind of think he says, it, says everything about this remarkable talent. Um, you know, people, I am just so fascinated by this young lady because 17 and you're running 10.94. Just think about that. And you are running against the two fastest women on earth and you are not phased. You are not intimidated. You are not scared. I was expecting 1089 after that semi-final. Um, 1089. Yes, I know. But you'll see it later on. Um, she said she had a misstep. I don't know what that was. Um, today, I thought she looked better yesterday, actually, because her mother is sick, and I think her mother passed the sickness on to her. So she had a fever in the back. So we were a little concerned about that before the semi-final. But she looked great in the semi-final, and. Um, Brianna is, Brianna is not normal. She's not normal. Seven, at 17 years, you're not supposed to line up next to the two Olympic champions, beat them out of the blocks and hold on. So um, you saw a little glimpse of it last year at the, um, at the World Under 20 Championships, and she's continuing to progress. So I'm very happy for her. What next now? I mean, I know Worlds is like some three months away. Um, your job as a coach now to keep her in mind for that time. Well, this is only her fifth race for the, her fifth final for the year. She has been, the entire year has been geared to getting ready for September, not June. We knew we had to come here ready to run on the 11 because we saw, you know, what, what was going on with PR and everybody else. But um, my job is, my job is easy now because we play with house money. She's 17 years old. 
So you have a 17 year old running 10 9. She, I know she didn't run a, a great race. She had to run a good race tonight. She knows she didn't run a great race tonight. So there's more there. We'll go back to work. She has a bunch of races coming up. Um, she's going to run NACAC under 18. She's going to run Pan Am Juniors. She'll probably run Pan Am Seniors. So she has. She's enjoying it, you know. She has no stress. Like I said, she's playing with house money. Okay, man. Thank you. All the best. Thank you. Brianna, not normal. Atta Bolin is right. She's not normal. From age 13, you're running 12.25. 17, you're running against Elaine Thompson, Hera, and Shelley and Fraser Price, and you're running 10.94. People. Brianna Williams, not normal. Real thing. So let's look at her 200 meters. Another personal favorite race of mine is her world championships on the 20 200 meter run in 2018 where she won Twenty-two point five zero people. A new championship record at the time. Wow. Look, if you agree that Brianna Williams no normal, if you agree that Brianna no normal, thumbs up this video right now. Right now, people, thumbs up this video. Of course, at the same World Championships on the twenty, she runs the hundred meters, beating the favorite Tanisha Terry, running eleven point one six. Can... Williams, the championship record holder, Terry. We're about meters at the World Under 20 Championships. Yeah. 15 year old ahead of Terry at the moment. She fought, she surged, but she couldn't get Williams. And it's a gold for Jamaica, a silver for the US. The title for Jamaica, 11.16 seconds, and to Anisha Terry. But Brianna Williams, it is possibly the upset of the championship it so was far. the upset of the championships. She won the 100 and 200 meters. And people, Brianna Williams was 16 years old. 16 years old. Another record being she was the youngest person to achieve this goal, 16 years old, winning the 100 and 200 meters at the World Athletics Under 20 Championship in Tampere. You Listen, you've got to give it up for great, immense, remarkable talent. And I'm going to keep saying it, this young lady, Brianna Williams, is not normal. Brianna Williams, no normal. I think sometimes we don't we don't quite realize that it's not normal for a 16 year old, or a 13 year old, or a 15 year old, or a 19 year old to be running these kinds of times, breaking records consistently. Brianna Williams, no normal people. So another one of my favorite races from her is this one, earlier this year at the national trials for the Olympics, the semifinals of the women's 100 meters. Just look at her race. Dominant. She shuts down a se seven meters before the finishing line, runs 11 seconds flat and makes it look easy. 19 years of age, makes it look easy. This is, there's a specific thing about the way that Brianna Williams runs, why I enjoy watching her races. And I mean, every athlete has aspects of their race that are unique and different. But Brianna's running style is, is almost textbook in many respects. Look at this. She gets out really, really fast, of course, almost like a Shelly and Fraser Price. She keeps her body low heading into her drive phase. Those knees are high, arms pumping, she's relaxed. She runs almost a perfect race. Watch again. She stays low for the first 20 to 25 meters. Gently moves up into her drive phase. Look at those knees, high. Arms, shoulders relax, face relax. 
arms pumping and you can see she literally shuts down shuts down a full seven meters before understand that the young lady running beside her is is, is no slouch you get what i'm saying kemba nelson is one of our best and she moves away from kemba nelson with absolute ease look you're talking about a young lady who's running against the best in the world and it, it, it's easy easy my father that's an easy like sunday morning <laughs> remarkable talent this is another one of my personal favorites from the inside Peter, Nathan, White. Gardner, Williams, Briscoe, Bryant, and Rosaletta. That's Brianna Williams. Love to make it. It's June 5th, 2021. Miramar, Florida, at the NACAC New Life Invitational. She runs 10.97 in a plus 1.2 wind, 10.97, establishing a new national junior record for Jamaica. So there you have it. Brianna Williams' greatest races are certainly some of them because I'm sure there are going to be many more in the future. If you believe that Brianna Williams, no normal, if you believe that Brianna Williams is not normal, if you believe that Brianna Williams is normal, hit the thumbs up button hit the thumbs up button and write in your comments hashtag Brianna no normal okay hashtag Brianna no normal hit the thumbs up button all right people thank you so very much for making a Peter Lloyd world if you have not subscribed make sure to subscribe leave those comments hit the thumbs up and as always bless up <laughs>